think Cass is better than Hard and Liliana? Yeah! I'm starting to really regret turning Liliana, mm, hardening Liliana like that. Wait, uh, phrasing. Whoops, um, giggity. <laughs> so if we kill Corypheus, he has the power to move from one tainted creature into another? <laughs> what we will learn next? That he can command the sun to rise or the seas to burn? All right. <clears throat> We uh, best prepare for it. Can we prepare for flaming seas? Maybe collect all the snow from the frost bags just in case? <sighs> I see what I can do. I have researchers scouring the Temple of Mythol as we speak. I hope that their search turns up something we can use. Ancient magic, perhaps. Something even Corypheus missed. Anything to give us an edge. Ah, carry on. I'll leave you to your work. Okay. I need to do something real quick, chat. I Oh, excuse me. Sorry. <clears throat> I need to order No. Why? Well, that's weird. That's a weird one. <clears throat> oh. Well, you suck. Dominoes? Okay. All right. Looks like that was still good. Huh. Awesome. Uh, yep, I'll take you. I'm right, if you're wondering what I'm doing, I'm ordering food right now because I'm hungry. And I can't exactly just leave the stream just to make something. I mean, I could, but what would that do for you guys? Anyways. All right, definitely going to get that. Go ahead and get you. I could just get a two liter... Four cups and uh, we want a dessert. Mm, no, oh. Maybe I do want that. Okay, there we go. And boom. Pay for this expensive order because, you know. Oh, no. I screwed that up. Yep. And place order. Yay. Sweet. All right. You are all set. Now let's go talk with everybody else. We got lots of people. Lots of people to talk to. Also, turn in research. 
The Empress has gifted us with a selection of rare books. I can't wait till they arrive. Well, that was great of him. What happened at the Elven Temple? It's got me thinking. I should go back, shouldn't I? To Tavinta. Once this is done, if we're still alive. All my talk of how terribly wrong things are back home. But what do I do about it? Nothing. But brought this on. How does this relate to the Elven Temple? That elf, Avalas. He said the Imperium wasn't what destroyed the Elves. My people would never accept that. It would reduce us to scavengers, destroy our legacy no matter how terrible. But we should accept it. Take our history down a peg. Confront the legacy hanging over us like a shroud. Maybe not all of us want to, but that could be altered. If you can change minds, so can I. You can do great things. Someone with your impeccable taste could transform to Vinter. I hope you're right. You usually are. It might surprise you to know that you're the one who inspired me. You're shaping the world for good or ill. How could I aspire to do any less? If it means proving that Tevinter can be better, that there's hope even for my homeland, I would do anything. But what about Paul? What about Paul? Wrong way. Because if you go back, what? What about Bull? What's this? Oh, that's a bit sad. He'd be leaving Bull. Far be it for me. My dear, I know you must have a great deal on your mind right now, but I need to speak with you. You know as well as I how far the Inquisition's influence has spread, and how desperate grand okay. clerics have become. Our opinion will be instrumental in their election of the new divine. One of our own may be divine. They want Leliana and Cassandra as candidates. The Inquisition may not be invited to their vote, but our actions will certainly influence the Grand Clerics. To sit on the Sunburst throne, a candidate should have grace, charm, and a will of solid steel. Cassandra may lack the first two, but unless you can think of someone better, she is the strongest choice. What platform do you support? What would your ideal divine do with her power? The most important thing, of course, is the restoration of the Circles and the Templar Order. The institutions that have protected Sadus for ages must be rebuilt and the malcontents utterly crushed. We cannot allow anarchists to threaten the lives of the innocent. After we have restored sanity to the world, there will be time to address voices of dissent. Uh, where else can we look? Where can we find candidates outside of the Chantry? There must be someone other than Leliana or Cassandra. The Chantry is already desperate. They would not look to unordained women if they had any choice. You may have better luck searching the halls of the Imperial Court. There are many women serving the Empire who have the necessary presence and acumen. Well, no, I agree with you. I think Cassandra would be best for <clears> the <throat> job. This could Cassandra have actually been the part is our where only we hope of restoring order after all profile. this chaos. I knew you would see it as I do. We will have to be very mindful of everything we do and say, for the Conclave certainly is doing the same. If they look to the Inquisition to provide a sign of the Maker's will, we will have to give them the right one. It's been quite the momentous day, hasn't it, my dear? How do you feel? It's not every day one absorbs ancient elven magic. I'm getting used to it. It was strange at first, but I think I'm all right now. Good. 
We can't have you falling to pieces on the eve of such an important battle. The pieces are nearly in place. We'll soon strike against Corypheus directly. You've done well. I will be proud to fight alongside you when the time comes. I always have time for you, my dear. Never mind. All right. Next area will be here. Victory in the Arbor Wilds. The Archdemon might have been a real threat to our army, but it flew off once we turned the tide. It is still out there, however. I wonder what Corypheus plans now. <clears throat> if he returns, we'll face him. We'll deal with whatever he throws at us. Do not underestimate Corypheus. He is powerful, and you have yet to fight him one-on-one. -on -one. But he will come. You will get your chance. I look forward to it. If he tries, he'll regret it. I believe you. Not long ago, this was impossible to imagine. You, a valued friend, victory close at hand. The time has come to consider what will come next. You'll be divine. You'll be the next divine, I assume. That has not happened yet. But it may. If the Maker wills it, then yes, I will answer his call. Blessed are they who stand before the corrupt and the wicked and do not falter. You have come far, my friend. It has been an honor. I, I am curious as to what companions we will get in the next game. Like, I think we got pictures of, like, uh, of a couple of them, or at least art styles. Though all before me is shadow, yet shall the Maker be my guide. I shall not be left to wander the drifting roads of the beyond. For there is no darkness in the Maker's light, and nothing that he has wrought shall be lost. A prayer for you. For those we have lost, and those I am afraid to lose. You haven't lost your faith. I'm glad you haven't lost your faith. I've questioned it at times, but I found comfort in faith when life offered little. Corypheus will retaliate. It's only a matter of time. We must draw strength wherever we can. Never ends, does it? Unless he gets bored and surrenders. Any chance of that? <laughs> I doubt it. Oh, bollocks. I'm in here. No! You go back up there. Ah. Because he may have something else for us. Also, we need to talk to uh, Black, uh, Blackwall. Hmm, there's concept art for companions, presumably, but the concept art is just to capture the feel of something or someone. They may change radically. Yeah, true. Corypheus is able to possess Grey Wardens, or so I hear. Perhaps it's a good thing I'm not a real Warden. A very good thing. It's a blessing. Warden or not, I'd hate to be on the other side of your blade. Going up against a Darkspawn, and the last thing you want is a Grey Warden. Funny how these things happen. Kind of ironic, too. We'll talk later. Nothing right now. Perhaps in a bit. Oh, that was kind of lackluster for Blackwall. Hoping, hoping though that we get the sexy Quinara lady and then 
Navarin skeleton possessed by a spirit? Agreed. I do not like having that mirror, Illuvian, in Skyhold. Corypheus may not be able to travel through it, but what if something else can? I trust Morrigan with it. I don't think Morrigan would keep it here if that were true. Yes. Morrigan said as much when I asked her. Oh? She said I was unreasonable, then offered to explain how the Illuvian works using words with less than four syllables. Ah. The Circle had a library. I'm fairly well read. Right. I'm not unreasonable. That's all. That's all for now. I'm sure you have other matters to attend. Oh, he gets a cutscene after I do the altar mission. Okay. Please, is if his uh, approval is high. I think it's high enough. We'll see. We will see. I. I suppose you're right. <laughs> Knew you couldn't stay away. What's new? What's been going on? Ambassador Montelier sent me a basket of flowers to thank me for my work with the Inquisition. She's so lovely. I should go. All right, Bull. So to kill Corypheus, all we have to do is kill his dragon first? That's easy. We're good at killing shit. Just one more big fight to put this Magister asshole down for good. I knew you'd get us here, boss. I'm ready and eager. I've been waiting for the chance to pay that bastard back. Yeah, this is gonna be fun. I'm running drills. They're drinking. All right, Sarah is going to be the last one we talk to. Corypheus died, and then he didn't. That's why he always felt wrong, like he didn't fit inside himself. He wears another man's life. I thought dying was forever. <laughs> You and me both. So did I. Corypheus seems to break a lot of rules. But is it him? Is he real? If a man can be dead and then not... Could I have saved the real Cole? You did all you could. What happened to him wasn't your fault. His hands were bruised from beating on the wall. It was dark, like the cabinet where he hid to escape his father. His belly hurt like knives, throat cracked dry. He was alone. I pushed through and held his hand. It was all I could do. He said, thank you. Thank you. You're welcome, Cole. All right. Another beer. Come here, you. Oh. That was loud. All right. Cheers, guys. I was just seeing how high the foam on this would go. <sighs> Anyways. Michael is more human? He is. I was debating whether or not to have him be more uh, spirit than human or not. And I was like, not... Treat everybody the same. Treat him like a human. Treat him like a person. Oh, hi, 
yeah. Listen, stand there. Right there. Now, about Mithal. What should my reaction be? Sarah, I don't know what reaction you want, but can this be it so we can be done? All right. So maybe it's still you. Someone needed to do something. I mean, you went wading into a well of sorrows. Who hears that and thinks, well, Dunker Butt, let's have a go. Even mad old Abelas said elves destroyed themselves. The only believable bit in a sea of clear demon bait. It makes messing with their relics real stupid. So, test done. You're still you. We can leave these lies behind. This threat was a test? How was aiming an arrow at my face a test? I heard once that if you're possessed, the demon will defend itself against attack. Sounds stupid to say it out loud. I don't know. I don't know demons. At least, if it's true, the arrow's right there. I'm sorry, yeah. Morrigan's probably got better ways, but who can trust her? Never again, you hear me? You never do that to me again. Fine, all right. Sorry I don't know how to deal with rubbish no one was meant to. Do you think Mithal was all lies? You seem pretty certain. You don't believe anything from Mithal. Of course not. Well, I should believe all that stuff, because elves. I mean, it was impressive and all. Makes the Dalish look like tits for living in the woods, but so what? There can't be a bunch of gods and the Maker. Don't matter how much or little you believe, those don't fit. So call me stupid, but I believe the stuff not made up by dead people who failed. Mithal is a ruin full of demons. I mean, it just makes sense, right? I agree. It was all lies. I'm with you. Everything in that temple was highly suspect. Oh, good. I was worried you were going elfy on me. Come on, let's get ready for lumpy. And by lumpy, I mean kariffy shit, not your bits, because that would be gross. Lumpy bits. So yeah, I'm done. Food? <laughs> God, I love Sarah. I love Sarah. All right, no one else to talk to, right? Yeah, I don't think I have anyone else to talk to. But all right, let's get going. Yeah, she is. Oh, hello. I don't understand that. What is that by exactly? When the game does that, is that like not rendering property or is that a memory? Link? I don't have to agree with her, by the way. I still agreed with her. But you guys saw what happened with the game right there, didn't you? When I loaded in out here. Never that never had that happen to you? Huh. Interesting. And by the way, this going to this altar thing. We'll be spread thin until the rest of our forces return from the Arbor Wilds. Of course. Never had your spells lingering in Skyhold either? Oh. Ah. <clears throat> uh. Am I missing something?
Hmm, things around the Inquisitor. Oh, the Shroud. The, uh, uh, Sarah's ability. The, uh, Lost in the Mist. Never had that? Huh. Wait, what? Ah, here. And she was like, no. Oh, that was, that was confusing. That was confusing. Thought I had to go to the, uh, it's here. I can feel it. Are you certain it's still in one piece? I'm sure it's here. Just keep an eye out. There it is. This is all that's left of the altar. We few who travel far, call to me and I will come. Without mercy, without fear. I'm here, Flemeth, just as you told me. If I must master a dragon to fight Corypheus, then send it. Wait, oh god, I gotta work on everybody uh, uh, got my guy's skills. Okay. Uh tactics for Sarah uh Flask of Frost is useless. Well actually now nah, we'll keep it on. For Dorian on the other hand, I think this is a fire dragon, so Disable that. Disable. This is useless, so disable that. Lightning's fine. Revival's... Okay, every, uh, static cage, I think, is pretty useless. I'll keep it up anyways. Right, and then bull. Oh, grappling chain has been... Oh, okay, yeah. Uh, mighty blow. I suppose we'll keep that. Ring of pain, war cry, world. Okay, everything else, we'll keep on. Just an, got a curiosity. What's your level? Twenty-five. Ooh, this ought to be a. This ought to be a fair fight. And oh, rude. Did you already use your... Yes, he did. Okay. right there so we'll go ahead and <clears throat> and super easy ah okay hack on is harder yeah hack on is definitely harder 
There you go. That's what I want. Bullets. Hey, Dorian, do you want to help Sarah, please? Where are you at? guys that was believed it it will come when i summon it once that's enough to fight corypheus however i have my dragon so when we find him we'll fight between two dragons <laughs> mad plan love it <laughs> <laughs> yeah now we're now we are kind of at the point where i do wish i given it to morgan but you know what oh well i already made my decision already made my decision If I, if I, if Morgan drinks from the, uh, from the well, I don't need to do this part. Yeah. To be honest, this, this is kind of why I wanted to do it. I don't know why I drank from the well, so, uh, well, so that way I can also, that way I can fight the dragon. I just wanted to fight the dragon, really. That's all. Mostly. But anyways, does everybody have anything more to say? Good to see you, boss. See you later, Bo. Nice talking with you, boss. All right, my food's on the way. What's up, your crew? My what? If nobody else really has anything else to say. All right, one final kiss before. <laughs> Come here. But Morgan turning into a high dragon, though. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Oh, where's the door? Oh. 